G'day, in today's video, I'm gonna be checking out the Aperture MRAN baby pin adapter for the tube lights. This is the 3 8 screw with the RE locator pins. This helps the light not kind of unscrew itself when it's up on a boom. So I got this off Amazon, it's about 49 Australian dollars, took about two weeks to get here. Now I actually ended up deciding on this mount after watching Peter Mokri's YouTube channel video on this. And this video really was spot on for what I needed. So I'm really grateful he made this. And if you haven't already checked out his work, make sure you jump on over, lots of great videos. And he is full of absolute dynamite tips. Now I'm putting the light together. It always cracks me up with these tube lights that I forget to kind of push the little button on the power on the battery, gets me every time. Now there's a great amount of mounting points on these tube lights already. So you've got the three points on the back of the tube itself that have the locator points. You're gonna to wanna to use in most times the kind of one closest to the battery, given the amount of weight that is hanging off the back there. Now you could just screw this to any old 3 8 or 5 8 depending on the mount. But what happens is without those locator pins is the weight of the battery can often start to kind of turn the light off those screws. And the few times that I'd tried it prior, that was definitely what was starting to happen. And you could, I just didn't feel secure enough. So hence why I went and got the uh, this mount with that option. I did notice there's a little bit of give between the actual baby pin and that little black part that has the aperture on there with the, the twisty screw. Uh, I've tried to tighten it up, but still seems to have a little bit of give. Now, I'm not sure if that's specific to this one particular mount or, you know, it seems like it's the tiniest amount of give, but it just kind of makes me a tiniest bit uncomfortable, but I will give it a crack to see if I can get it any tighter in the future. I'm fairly confident it's, the black bit moving on the baby pin there. I might be able to chuck some Loctite in there or something. Now, once you get it up on a C stand, I really like having this secure point. Um, you could totally use this for a hair light. I'm just using my iPhone to film this, so obviously it's blown out. So overall for 50 bucks, I'm pretty happy. A little bit on the pricey side but just makes me feel more secure in hanging this over Talent's head and uh, not letting it fall down or twist off. So I hope you have a great week and we'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.